the Samsung Galaxy S4 and the error in question is as follows. Unable to charge, charging pause, battery temperature too low. So now the problem here is that there is either a damaged, faulty, defective, or incorrect charging port. So the solution is to change that part. So we're going to be changing that right now. In order to replace the charging port, the first step is to power off the phone. So that's fully off. Remove the back cover. Pull out the battery. Okay, take off all of these screws. One of them is already Pretty straightforward, you just need to use a small size standard screwdriver. These screws are all the same size, so you don't have to worry about getting them mixed up. After all the screws removed, next step is to remove this plastic bezel. I'm doing it with my fingernail. You can also use a plastic spudger, but if you have a good fingernail, the best way is to just run your fingernail into that crack and run your finger around the whole thing. So that bezel has been removed. This is it right here. Just set that one aside. Now, to remove the charging port, we gotta remove this flex cable right here. You can also use a plastic spudger, but I prefer to use my fingernail. Now we remove this little one down here. Now this appears to be the correct charging port because that letter T indicates it's for T-Mobile and it's the M919, which is the model we have in question. But we're gonna try a different one and see if that solves our problem. You gotta remove this one down here. Normally, you're going to need a heat gun to remove this, but since this is already a replacement one, you can go ahead and pull it up. But if this is the first time you change the part, you will need a heat gun. Now there's usually this metal bracket that's holding it down. This time it got stuck inside of the door. It's fine. We'll leave it where it is. Now we gotta reconnect that antenna cable right there. Next step is to put this metal piece back on. Now we can just put this plastic frame back on and test it out. We don't need to put in these screws here. Those do not need to be installed in order to test it.
it's charging, so that shows the new charging port. It's good, and that way it fixed the problem. So again, the cold battery temperature error is almost always due to a bad charging port. Either incorrect piece, broken piece, or damaged piece.